I moved back into my parents about a year ago because I got out of our relationship. Uh, we don't really move back into your parents for a good reason, do you? <laughs> I said, oh, I've got a promotion at work, so I thought Mummy and Daddy could do with some company. <laughs> so. It's usually it's either emotional issues or financial issues. My dad called mine the double whammy. <laughs> As soon as I moved back into them, I thought, I've got to start dating again. I need an out plan, right? On my first date back, I was terrified, right? It didn't help, right, that the guy was a bit weird. Uh, oh, yeah, guy, I'm a gay person. <laughs> Key change, here we go, sisters! <laughs> That's right, I'm a sodomite. <laughs> Nothing more scary than a Glaswegian gay man. I'm gonna bum you. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, mate. You're heterosexual? Yeah, I'll nod to the head there. Yes, I love the vulva. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know, I had to change my voice for that. Yes, I love the vulva. Larry Jean, BBC News, I'm very gay. <laughs> Yeah, this is my favourite bit of any gig, man. I love this bit. It's so much fun, because I'm just looking at all the straight men in the room looking at me going, hold on, he's gay? He doesn't look gay. I don't look gay. Maybe I'm gay. <laughs> oh, never, actually, to be honest, I don't even like the word gay. I'm not a fan of the word gay, because the word gay gets used quite derogatory sometimes. That people are like, oh, that's gay, I don't like that, that's gay. In Scotland, we don't even need to use that word. In Scotland, we can describe somebody as a homosexual by using any noun in the English language. <laughs> like, what? Is he a blueberry, eh? <laughs> oh, see that guy? I've heard he's a lava lamp. I found this out when I was having an argument with my dad, right? Because I could see my dad wanted to call me a big Jesse, but I could see him thinking, I don't know if that's homophobic now, actually. <laughs> so my dad went, ah, oh, get lost, you big duvet. 